take the RV. Don't be crazy. You're not letting me take it. Sorry, Lee. I really am. Okay. Holy shit! She's stealing the RV! How were her hands? Come back here, you crazy bitch! She, I guess she untied her hands, but... Fuck! Stop! It's okay, we have a train. We'll be fine. Honestly, the train is probably safer than any car, because... The train is just a lot more solid of a structure. Let's... Let's, let's focus just focus on, on the train. train. Yeah, we're fine. Screw that. What was that? Well, we're fucked if we don't figure out how this thing works. Can't spend the night out here. Was that the walker that was in that car that tried to jump scare us? What? Elke's still sick, you know. We need to get to the city, the coast. I'm aware. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah, should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. How hard Sounds were they good. writing? Okay, on six, it's down, down, up, 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 down, up. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Kind of hard to tell what that set, what that's supposed to mean, but I think I'm supposed to twist a knob. So on five... Now we're talking. Okay. It's all yours. Damn it. Oh. Of course. We're still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? And get us unstuck? Yeah. Sure. I really don't want to deal with Kenny. Now that Carly's gone? Or uh, now that. Well, I guess, yeah. Now that Lily's gone, though, I want him to go away. Have it be just me, Ben, and Clementine. Hell, even Ben can go away, because I'm not really interested either. <laughs> Back here. Yes, it is. Kenny, we're loose. <laughs> that zombie was not happy about that. You touch any of my stuff? Hello? Um. Who are you? The guy who owns that stuff. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, Hi. if you fancy. Lee. Hi, Chuck. Your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him, too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Mm hmm. Strange folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. Oh. It's so oh. nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy <laughs> then too. <laughs> I was about to disagree with that. I mean... Okay. You have candy? You sure. Have candy. Boy, I got the last piece I got on me. Figures. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. Uh -uh. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. 
Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on... Uh... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Mm-hmm. Oh, that makes me want to play my guitar. Well, I guess I'm gonna go get the car... So that's the train it. car We're going? Loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. Who the fuck are you talking to? He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. Bro, you talk to her like that again. You're catching these hands. Is the train really a good idea with Duck like that? Maybe we should focus on one thing at a time. Yes. What can we do here? Get on the train and we find something better. That Bro. is the plan. I think Lee just Calm your the ass down. It's talked through. Get on, Kent. It's... You don't I'll just get to... Front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going. You don't get to just strong arm this shit. Don't make me toss your ass. Don't, don't make me. Let me, let me get this sh shit straight. Like, hmm. Uh, hmm. Okay. That's the throttle. Yes, I, I know. <laughs> Damn it, Lee. <laughs> Don't look at me. I'm not your friend. Talking to Clem any kind of way. Fuck out of here, dude. I was literally just playing detective with him too. That makes me really sad. Because I don't think he's surviving this. If any of you have seen the show, The Walking Dead, dying from a bite, the worst way to go. After the first season of the show, so few people opt for that way to actually go out because it's just absolutely miserable and terrible. Taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. <laughs> well, accurate. It is. Your daughter's yeah. something. Keep else. it real. Just say it. She's a She's survivor. A survivor. You don't have to tell to everybody. Well. Except her dad, looks like. Lee. Lee, I need you. Oh, right no. Now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. I got you. I got you. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Kenny, if you fight me too hard on this, I'm going to wreck your shit. Come back here and be with your son. Swear to God, Kenny, don't fight me on this. You need to stop the train. will be fine. He won't be. He's going, Kenny. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. St 
stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? Or you're gonna get knocked on your ass. Or thrown off the train. Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. How many sons are you going to let die? Shut your mouth! Bro, I'm winning this fight. I hope you know. Just leave me the oh. fuck alone! I don't need you, and Doc doesn't oh. need you! Oh. If you don't win this... I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna... You better stop. You better stop. There's no reason for this. Give a fuck that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck. Bro, how many times are you about to try this shit? You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing Duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. Okay, I think I'm about to kill him. Okay. Never mind. I was like, that's not what I wanted. Didn't want to kill him. Saying sorry to you, dumbass. Get your ass back there. Talk to Katya. Stop the train while you're at it, too. Go back there and be with your wife and son. And it's... I think it's time. Boy's been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if, what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But no. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. He can just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Gotcha. Fuck. I, I, I can I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. Honestly, though, no. it's He's too right, much. Kat. It's we too can much. We say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, <laughs> you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course.
What are you doing? I'm putting him out of his misery. I wouldn't want to say I'm killing him. Yeah. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Wait, they walked away together. Wait, is Kenny about to kill all of them? Kenny? What happened? Oh, did she shoot Get, herself? Get, gotcha. Why, Cat? Honey? Oh, fucking God. <laughs> she shot herself? What the hell happened? What did you- She couldn't- She, 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 she just- Fuck. Oh, oh, oh fuck. Okay. Oh no. I feel like Kenny's about to kill himself too now. And I don't I don't love that at all. What do we do? That's too much. Kenny. Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. I think if I let him keep the gun, he's gonna shoot himself too. I don't want that. I shouldn't have even let them walk away. Who's watching us? I don't like Kenny, but goddamn, that's just too much. <sighs> yeah, I I don't regret that. If I had um if I had let him like do it himself, I think he was going to shoot himself next. Which I guess go out on your own terms, I suppose. Because the world is already kind of terrible, but god dang it. Hello? What the fuck did you say to her? Hey, how you doing? What's your problem, dude? I don't care what reasons you had for doing it. No reason to go and tell my girl she's gonna end up dead. No, she is. Well, that's why you're wrong. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow that y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We do what's best for Clementine. Oh, well then, you do have it all figured out. Never mind. Look, I don't care what Chuck doesn't like. Hash it out. So that I doesn't really bother me. For Christ's sake, I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. I mean, like a gun. Are you kidding me? What? She's too young to handle one? There ain't too young. No, Not I mean, I, I agree. She you should learn how to use a gun. Consider her a living person. That's it. 
You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Well, look at her hair. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. Well, I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. You that have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. You're homeless then? Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. <laughs> Be safe up here. You betcha. Hey, Ben. Hey. You okay? Well, I don't feel like any of those are good See options. Ya. Yeah. I'm not cutting her hair. So, I mean. Oh, that's where Duck was bleeding. This train much longer. Wait, he asked me if I had a drink, but there's literally a bottle of whiskey back here? What? Okay. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh. He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I'd like that. Good. Um, what do you, what think, do think, you about think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. Um. What a crappy day. Crappiest. If three months ago I'd known what you'd be seeing, I don't know if I would have taken you with me. I probably would have run out of food. You damn near starved with me. I'm glad I came with you. Oh. I'm not cutting her hair. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? Good advice. It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. I don't suggest shooting in the train. Is there anything else I should know? Aim for the head. I know these are just bottles, but you have to aim for the head. I know. Only the head. Unless it's not well, a walker and it's someone trying to hurt you. And then... There we go. Head or body. Anywhere. I don't want to think about that. You're right. It might be a lot for your first day. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You got this. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. Eee! You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Um, I mean, 
mean, you shot. So aim left. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. Okay, a little higher. Okay. A little bit more to the left. Aim lower. A bit to the right. Close. Now keep it steady. There you go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. Oh, we're doing another one? I feel like that's that was more than enough for one day. So aim, aim right. More to the right. And then aim, aim higher. A little higher. There you go. Nice. Hmm. I, I love the detail that she like he's I did it! Yeah, you did. Good correcting job. her locked arms every single time. They were walker heads. Good. Just Good. like you should. They're not walkers though. No, no, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay. I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh uh. We'll work on her passing the gun to people later. <laughs> you taught Clementine to protect yourself. I'm I'm not gonna cut her hair. My hands hurt and my ears have noise in them. Like You'll get used to it. Am, is it gonna make me I cut her hair? Around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. Yeah, uh, me too. Hmm. Uh -huh. Okay, are they really gonna make me? I don't. They look I, clean enough. I really don't want to. I think it's. I, I don't really see the point of going all the way back to the front. So I think they're actually trying to make me cut her hair. I really don't want to. Can I at least talk to her about it first? Hey, Since sir. I have the scissors. Hi. Or am I just gonna do it? So you're probably not gonna like this. Oh no! What <laughs> happened? Nothing. We have to talk about <laughs> your hair. It's not safe. That's not nice. <laughs> what? Are you saying it smells? No. Cause it does. Kinda. Oh no. Do you remember when Andy St. John grabbed it and I got mad? Yeah. Well, that could happen again. And if it's a walker, well, we need to trim it. Just a trim, right? I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed. <sighs> okay. Hmm. Do I have to? Can I just wait? Mind if you do this now? It's fair. It's not unfair. I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. It's not an unfair thing. Do you know how to do this? Nope. How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. So you did kill someone before. Yeah. I'm glad you finally told me. Me too. Didn't I kind of tell you You've at the store? You've killed lots of now. It doesn't even matter. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay, I think I'm about done. I can probably tie these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Uh, yeah. Lily gave them to me for sleeping. Hmm. There, all set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. A lot? Uh, huh? Okay. Hmm. <laughs> I don't feel too happy about that. Well, I already... I don't... Hi. Kenny? Can I talk to Kenny? Hey. hey. It'll be good to get to the water. 
Uh, maps? Any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. I'll just take that I one. If I could buy you for a second, Kitty. Can you just leave me alone? How? I literally just said to you. It's full of maps and documents. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Why are you so difficult? I don't like you. Yeah, it is for her safety, and she does understand it, but I feel bad. Well, the girl can shoot. It doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. Okay, well, that did nothing for me. I guess I'm gonna... Damn it, dude. Give me the map. Get out of here. Bro. What's your problem? Mind if I could buy you for a second, Kenny? Can you just leave me alone? Okay, so it doesn't escalate any further than that. Well, what am I supposed to do? Hey. Yeah. Okay. You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Yeah. It's the best plan. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure... Cat would be, uh, okay with you, so forget it. Okay. Okay. Can I have the map? You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Oh my god. You just, I, I just had a conversation with you about how I need a map. Like, I, I just, you know I'm trying to grab the map there. I could also say I need that map right there, but my communication skills are also shit for some reason. So, there's that. Hey, Ben. Hey. I guess I'm gonna talk to everyone. Carly didn't have to die, you know. She would have killed me instead. Yeah, maybe. Aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. Are you going to be able to step up? I can do just as much as anyone else. Good. I hope that's true. See you. Yeah. Okay. I'm sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute, though. My mom isn't going to like it. Uh, what do you, what think, do you think about, about Chuck? Chuck? I guess. I don't know. Maybe it changed. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. Mm. I'll be right back. Okay. Okay. Okay, so I really do need that map, then. Because now I'm really at a dead end. God. And it doesn't let me stop at those compartments anymore, so I guess there's a puzzle here.